I loved swimming. It was my life. For years, 20-year-old Morgan Stickney enjoyed life in the water as an elite swimmer. I was ranked number one in New England for quite a bit of time, several years, um, in the mile and then also the thousand. But then Morgan's left foot started to hurt, an injury that never healed. We saw a doctor and he just said I had sesamoiditis, which is inflammation on the sesamoid bone. I was in excruciating pain all the time. My foot was never a normal color. Morgan's injury happened six years ago, and after several failed surgeries, she came here to Boston for this experimental surgery, which will help her live a better life. In a simplistic uh, sense, what we do is create a smarter limb. Morgan's surgeon says her leg was amputated under the knee in a modified way to retain muscle function. He says she's the ninth person in the world to undergo this experimental operation. Once she is fully healed, when we ask Morgan to move her phantom ankle, if we look at her residual limb, we'll literally see these muscles moving back and forth. Which will allow her to better use a prosthetic, a method developed by researchers at MIT. By coupling the operation with a new type of prosthetic device, that we create a whole new system-based approach to taking care of patients with injuries like Morgan's and give them much higher functional um, capabilities. He said it's not guaranteed to work, but the success rate is high so far. And with the help of her dad, Morgan's already looking forward to getting back into the pool, running a marathon, and being there for other amputees. I know there's people out there that don't have that support, and I want to be able to help people that, are, that don't have that because it's hard. It's not easy, and but you can do it. I did it. In Boston, Kristen Carosa, WMUR News 9.